Hey everybody, I just got home and I'm having myself a little snack and I absolutely love this container because look, it has little nutcrackers on it all the way through and I love nutcrackers and I want to draw your attention real quick to my big nutcracker that I have right here. His name is Sergio and I love this guy. He's really big. I have some other nutcrackers too that hopefully I'll introduce to you later on. But I just got home and I wanted to have a snack. This is called Nuts and Bolts. And there's a YouTuber who is, um, welcome to my curls. Her name is Renee and she has um, a recipe for how to make nuts and bolts and it's actually really good and savory. I was like cereal and pretzels and this one happens to be like a whole gluten-free variety. So enough of that. What's my watch saying? Guys, the watch is saying it's December 13th. It's December 13th. Okay, that means there are 12 more days until Christmas, which is just, it's insane to me. The countdown is real right now. So let's look at, because it says December 13th, let's try to find the 13. And today, it's here at the bottom. So number 13. I don't, you know, I can't really tell what that is. It definitely looks like a sheep of some sort. Oops, my nails are super chipped. Don't look at those. Definitely looks like a sheep of some sort, but I'm not really sure what we're going to do today. So as per usual, let's go to the table of contents and see where we are. Let's see mommy's note. It says here, Christmas jokes. <laughs> All right, let's go to page 24. Let's see what this is talking about with Christmas jokes. Oh, December 13th. Look at all these jokes. They have them all placed in different ornaments. All of these different jokes that we're gonna listen to today. Ornament, ornament. I don't know if these are just, yeah, these are all ornaments, that's right. Very cool, all right. Oh, and then, okay. And then here's, oh, I see what it is now. That makes more sense. That's the picture that was in the flap. It's actually a sheep ornament, so that makes sense. Okay, yeah, I was like, I don't really, I don't really know what that was about. So let me grab a, a little bit more snack, because I'm hungry. Mmm. Christmas jokes. Where do snowmen keep their money? Where do snowmen keep their money? In a snowbank. <laughs> That's really, that's cute. All right, let's do the second, the second joke. How does a sheep say Merry Christmas? Feliz Navidad. <laughs> that, that's crazy, that's crazy. All right, let's see the next one. We'll do this one right here. Who has a jolly laugh, brings you presents, and scratches up your furniture. Who's doing that? It says Santa Claus. And I'm gonna bring you in because it says C-L-A-W-S, Claus, like, like a cat claws. Yeah, that makes sense if they're jolly, bringing you presents, scratching up the furniture. Let's go to this yellow one down here. What did one snowman say to the other snowman? Do you smell carrots? That's pretty funny, because you know how snowmen usually have a carrot nose? Oh, that's funny. Okay, going up here, this like longer shaped one. What did the hat say to the scarf? So what did the hat say to the scarf? You hang around while I go on ahead. Ah, ha, 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 ha. Oh my goodness, that's actually pretty good. These are pretty witty. Let's go to the circle. What is a librarian's favorite Christmas song? Hmm, what's a librarian's favorite Christmas song? The answer is Silent Night. Shh. In the library, they always want us to be quiet. We have to be quiet in the library. Silent Night, that's their favorite Christmas song. That's funny, that's funny. All right, how about we do the star? 
Which of Santa's reindeer has bad manners? Who has bad manners? Rude, Alf, Rudolph, Rude. Oh man, that's not nice, is it? He's got bad manners. All right, but that's just a joke. He's actually very sweet. How about this up here? We'll do the circular one that's yellow. Why are Christmas trees such bad knitters? They are always dropping their needles. Ah, oh, that is something. That's pretty funny. That's pretty funny. So when we're knitting, we use needles to knit and make blankets and things like that and mittens. Um, and you use these knitting needles with them. But then if you have a real Christmas tree, like my Christmas tree is fake, but if you have a real Christmas tree, you know that mom and dad and grandma and aunt and uncle, they are literally with a vacuum all the time vacuuming up the green needles that fall from the tree. Boy, did they make a mess. That's funny. They drop their needles. All right. How is the Christmas alphabet different from the ordinary alphabet? Ooh, the Christmas alphabet has no L. No L. No L. That's crazy. Whoa, these jokes are pretty funny. I don't know. I, I, I'm not used to having Christmas jokes read to me. I have to say they're pretty funny. If you need help with any understanding, ask your preferred adult. Ask your preferred adult. I'm going to continue having a snack. No, no, hold, hold. I got to do the second Christmas countdown advent calendar. And it's right here. But I have to be careful because remember the, the antlers. Oh, I'll move you instead. How about the antlers on this keep coming off. <laughs> now he's down to half an antler <laughs> stuck on there. Now today's the 13th, so I'm going to bring this over just a little bit so you can see the box number 13, which is right here. Open it up, and there's a drum in there. Almost like the little, little drummer boy. Do you remember when I brought him out? Bum, 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 bum. That is super cool. And you can see, just like all of our jo jokes were in ornaments, this is also an ornament. It's got a string on there, so it's ready to just be put right on the tree. How lovely. Happy December 13th, everybody. Have a good night.